delay of game, offense. So Look, man, Lewis, welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for stopping by. Here we are, another episode of the Dennis Ford in my career, right here on Madden 19. Doing things a little differently here for this episode. Uh, this will not be the norm going forward. We just wanted to kind of do things a little bit differently here for this, what is the last uh, game of this uh, season. But we are here in the second quarter. It is 10-10. Uh, uh, Denny has been able to get anything going. Mariota's been doing pretty decently. Had a couple of uh, deep picks. Uh, that's why we are, uh, or, or had a pick rather, had a couple of deep uh, passes. One of them led to a touchdown. Uh, that's where we are right here. I said this is a little different than what we're used to doing and accustomed to doing, but uh, this is the last uh, game of the uh, season because there's no way we make the playoffs. And they did get a touchdown the here. Offense now working their way back onto the field. And on the last go around, they really couldn't get anything going. They had to pump from deep inside their own territory, which means they're going to lose the field position battle as a general. Back to pass now for throw. Is it complete? He overthrew him. As you can see, folks, Denny not doing too well at all there. The Titans on third down. They've only converted once in four tries. This is third and seven. Hey, 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 hey. Working out of the gun, Mariota. Mariota got Jones another one. Jones complete. Ten at sixteen, hundred eighty-one yards, Jones one touchdown, one pick. Denny's setting out for this one. 44 seconds remaining. Titans will get the ball back at the beginning of the second half. Back to pass. Mariota got his man. Touch. It's almost a first down. Incomplete pass. Mariota. Offense now they work their way back onto the field. They're down here, but very much in this game. What, what's the tonality of a coach's talk when a game is within striking distance like this of intermission? Typically, what they're doing is emphasizing the things that went well in the first half and wanting more of that. Sure, you've got to go over some of the errors and clean up some things because there's a reason you're down. But overall, I think they want to stay positive. Stay He's going deep, team. Mariota. That ball is caught. That ball is a touchdown. What a pass for Mariota and a catch for Callaway. Look at that beautiful. Callaway with a beautiful, beautiful one there. Man, that was a thing of beauty. And the Titans will tie this one up with Stinkpin. Puts it through. 64, 19 yards on the return. Six yard reception to Humphreys. Derrick Henry with the two yard rush. Derrick Henry with the five yard rush. Pass knocked away. And the Titans will take over. Mariota 
Now to throw on first down. Incomplete. The middle, but it's incomplete. Ricky Seals Jones, the intended receiver. That'll bring up second down. And that's when he's got to be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there. You need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. And he'll take it across midfield and into Buffalo territory. Give him four on the ground there. They're now left with third and six. Typically, we think it's the strong safeties that are better tacklers, especially closer to the line of scrimmage amidst traffic. But in this case, that might be free safety coming up and making the big time play. Oh, incomplete. What the fudge was that? Fourth and six. That's a touchback by Glenn Fry. The heat is on, y'all. <laughs> Clayton Crawford goes down. Forty two yards as the Titans. Take over, trailing this one by seven now. Mariota. Do it away. Phase of perfection is something we all chase, whether it's playing this game or whatever we do. Hard to attain, but that's what they're searching for as that pass goes incomplete. Where was you throwing, Mariota? And another punt by the Titans, trailing it by seven now. That ends the third quarter. We go into the fourth. Derrick Henry. And it looks like they will punt it, or excuse me, we'll have a field goal. So the Titans now down by 10. how you throw for a whole heap of yards in a game. You get efforts like that from your receivers. How about him laying out for that catch? Yeah, X kind of makes a quarterback look a whole lot better. Play is Mariota for the sideline, and look at that catch. Dragging the toes, and that's going to be a first down. Well done. 16 yards there. Two straight plays of 16 yards and another first down. Mariota now a perfect 8 for 8 to start the second half. Not bad. First and 10. What? And his throw is incomplete. I'm not even sure I know who this guy is out there playing right now. This is very unlike him. One of the most accurate guys in the league. Totally off his game right now. I don't know. I was going to ask you what you pin it on, but defensively, they've been pretty solid. Well, sometimes, you know, those defenders, they get into the receivers pretty well, and if they chip away at their timing, it's going to affect what you're doing throwing the ball as well. Ricky Seal Jones is down. That's not good, folks. He's a good tight end. He's one of our best players on the on the team. Thing in this game today, including laying out for that one. A first down throw for Mariota. He's going to flip that out to the flat. It's complete, and they'll be inside the 25 now at the 24. They'll get a couple yards on that one, and that'll make it a second down. To the air again, Mariota out to the flat. That's complete to his running back. And he'll be brought down inside the 20 at the 19. Call it a gain of five. And that's going to bring up a third down. They'll run it now. Jenny didn't get it. Around the 
16. It's a pickup of three, but it brings up what will be an interesting fourth and one. Denny got it, just barely. First down, getting this one to the 14-yard line. The time to pull out the stops is now, and they convert there on fourth down. On first and 10, here's Mariota. Incomplete. It's going to be incomplete. The touch and time there critical for those types of throws. He put a lot of zip on that one. Needed just a little bit more finesse trying to get it to his back. So after the incompletion on first, now second and 10. To throw Mariota. This will be caught at about the six. And stopped a few yards shy of the goal line at the three. The Titans efficient passing on this drive. There's another first down. They'll try and run for it first and goal. And he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. He'll wind up losing a yard on the play. Mariota. A plays like this where the ball comes free, it's often unusual. So the Titans decide to punt here. I'm not sure why, but I thought an onside kick would be better. And it looks like the Buck 13 left. See as they get sent to take the field. They're down here in a one-score game, but the time it's a factor, but it's not a huge factor right now, is it? It's really not because this amount of time gives them a chance to run their offense, to go through play sequences. And this is what they work on every week in practice, usually on a Friday. They go over this type of a situation, late game situation. What are we going to do when we have the opportunity? They've called these plays a bunch of times. Now's their chance to execute them. Well, they have the opportunity now. Here's the execution. Give them 16 yards. The Titans need a big play here. Back to throw. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. What the fudge was you doing, Mariota? This game is absolutely extraordinary. Let's just face it. This offensive line flat out cannot handle this pass rush. It's been demonstrated time and time again. He'll look to throw. Yeah, we ain't got no timeouts. This was an ugly one, folks. A real ugly one. And Charles, I think when the schedule comes out, all teams, no matter where they're predicted to finish, talk about protecting your home turf. They were able to do that here in this one. Similar to a tennis match, right? Not letting them break your serve. That way you hold on to it. They got it done, and they feel very good about that. That was victory. bad, folks. So for Buffalo, the win means they'll finish in double digits at 10 and 6. And that is maybe not exactly what they were hoping for, but a better than average season nonetheless. Meanwhile, for the Titans, they wanted desperately to finish at 500, but that won't happen as it'll be a 7 and 9 season in the end. And they can take solace in the fact that this team never quit all the way to the end. All Charles right, folks. There you have it. Like I said, we come in in the second. Uh, we come in uh, a little bit differently than we usually do at the beginning of this uh, episode. I do appreciate you all stopping in. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a big episode in the next episode. Or a big episode next. We are going to be uh, heading into a brand new season for Denny. And we do got a trophy, a Richard Sherman League. So the Richard Sherman League will be our trophy we do get. Uh, so.
so like I said, it's a Richard Sherman League we do get. We're going to look real quick uh, at the way things are. Yearly rewards. Let's see what we got here real quick. Uh, yearly rewards. Did Denny Coach of the Year? Who got Coach of the Year? Bill O'Brien got Coach of the Year. 13-3 and three for that. Good gravy. Uh, Denny, nowhere to be found for the MVP. Ezekiel Elliott was the one that got the... Uh, Ezekiel Elliott was the one that got the uh, league MVP for the uh, the the league MVP there. So, so in the next episode, folks, in the next episode, we will uh, be starting another season with Denny, and in that season, will be. Let's see. That season will be season six for Denny. Season six will begin in the next episode, folks. We'll go ahead and skip through the playoffs and stuff. We'll find out who wins the Super Bowl and all that other good stuff. But if you're new, folks, I do appreciate your scratching call marks on the bottom right corner of your screen. Sniff and body into the bell icon. Become part of the notification squad. Do not forget to put a like in the video. It's much appreciated. Remember, always stay hungry. Hungry like the wolf. Wolf Bad Lewis. Ow!